come see me again when you've gotten them out, okay? Out and safe. Sound good? And hopefully we can talk about happier things. If you know of any. Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel here today, and we're back from The Walking Dead Season 4 video. In today's video, guys, I will be discussing why Lee did not return in Episode 4. What was the reasoning behind it? Because it, a lot of us had the inclination that after Lee had said, Come see me again when you've gotten him out okay, out and safe. We got the inclination that there was probably going to be another Lee flashback happening. And Clementine was going to go back to her, you know, dream world with Lee. And a lot of people thought, you know, it could be on the train again. It could be at her house. There was a lot of hints towards it, but it didn't happen. And in this video, guys, I'm going to discuss my reasoning and some, you know, stuff I found online about why this didn't happen. And why Clementine Lee didn't get that final scene, because a lot of people thought if Lee and Clementine had gotten a scene, that would have been a perfect final goodbye or, you know, some kind of thing. So, let's just discuss this, guys. Let's go for 1,000 likes if you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys subscribe, else if you haven't new. And, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and let's get straight into it. Let me know your thoughts down below as well. So the Lee flashback was something a lot of people expected. I even thought there was a very likely chance of it. And Kent Muddle, creative director of the final season, had a response to a question that asked this exact thing. So his answer, again, is a lot better than anything we could come up with as fans. And someone asked him, why wasn't there a Lee flashback? Was it because of time restraints, or did you think it was better just to have it off screen? And he literally stated this, better to have it off screen. The 403 flashback shows that Clem visits Lee in her mind when she's having problems. It's likely she'll continue to do so if she's ever in big trouble again. That's the see me again. It's a promise to Clem, the character, not the audience. So when he says, you know, come see me again when you've gotten him out, okay, out and safe. It's a promise to Clem that they're going to meet again at some point. Whether that is, you know, any time in the coming weeks and months after, you know, Clementine losing her leg and all that. Maybe she already had it, you know, after she had gotten her leg chopped off. Because it was actually confirmed it when, you know, Clementine got with the crutches. It had been a week, I think, after when she initially got her leg chopped off by AJ. So a lot of time had happened. And it's her coping mechanism. One of the few places she's ever expressed doubt about her actions. The new one being, you know, directly to AJ at the end. So yeah, Clementine's usually not one, yeah, to look down on herself and say, am I doing the right thing, you know, I hope I'm doing it, yeah, she expressed doubt in this flashback as well as with, you know, that scene with AJ, and he said, 404 also might as well have been a giant flashing neon sign over the door to the barn that says, this is just like what happened to Lee, so you know the players gets the connection with us saying anything actually showing him again would be overkill. I mean, yeah, he is right with this, the entire kind of barn sequence was like almost dead on to Lee so this is kind of like a good explanation it really does give you you know some reasoning behind it and as much as me and you guys would love to have seen Lee I think yeah it would have probably been overkill but I think it would have been you know perfect enough so let me go into what I think this is again from his perspective I'll link this down below in the description you guys can go check it out and read it for yourselves so let me go into why I think myself so I understand there's a lot of disappointment around why Lee didn't come back. I mean, I've seen it all around in the last week, guys. I can't tell you how many comments I've gotten. Why wasn't there a Lee flashback? Where's Lee? Why didn't he show up? You know, and it's unfortunate. It really is because I thought it would have been a perfect send-off. But again, I agree with what Ken Model had said. I just wish there could have been something. You know, I know there were the parallels with the barn and all that, like we had mentioned earlier. But seeing Lee and Clementine, one final goodbye, you know, Clementine saying, hey, Lee, I made it out. You know, I lost my leg, but hey, we made it out. I, I got pretty much everyone out and we're alive. We're safe. We're going to meet a new community and, you know, that caravan and all that. And we'll see how things go out. So maybe she'd be worried about that caravan, for example. We'll talk about this caravan in a couple days, in the coming days. And maybe they talk about that. But then, like, you know, having a final emotional hug or, you know, some kind of thing to say goodbye would have just been, God, talk about freaking making players want to cry, man. That would probably bring me to 
utter, you know, tears instantly. Seeing like a final goodbye though. But th the ending was phenomenal. You know, how they did that with Clementine doubting herself and then saying to AJ, you know, did I do a good job? And then, you know, AJ's like, thank you for everything. You know, and Clementine's like, you're welcome for everything. That's just, damn. Emotions. But, unfortunately, we'll never get another scene, scene with Lee again. So that episode 3 flashback probably is going to be the final time you guys will ever see Lee. We'll ever see Lee again in this story. Even if there's going to be like a, you know, DLC or another season or whatever they're going to do. Um, probably that's it for Lee. So, let me know what you guys think of this explanation down below in the comments. It's unfortunate. It's bittersweet. But... I think again, yeah, it is what it is. So, let me know what you guys think of this down below. If you guys would have wanted to see Lee, how would you want it to have been in episode 4? And do you think, is there even a chance we'll ever see him again in a Walking Dead DLC story? Or who knows what's coming in the future. So, I want to thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smack a like, hit that sub if you're new. And we'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.